guys, this is Siddharth and uh, today I'll be showing you how to drive an automatic car. So um, the car I'm going to be using today is the 2013 Honda Civic 1.8 VTEC and um, as you can see it has an automatic gearbox. So um, first let me start by explaining what these letters on the gearbox stand for. So P stands for park. Um, so you use it when you're at a standstill or you know when you want to park your car basically and the R is for reverse so that's when you want to move backwards the N is for neutral so neutral basically lets the, the car won't be in gear so you can move it you know back or forward um, by pushing it or like uh, tow your car or something like that and then drive is um, what you use to move in front so um, and then below drive there is the S which stands for sports mode. In some cars uh, this could also be an L which stands for lower gear. So basically in sports mode the car holds on to um, higher revs. Okay so to start the car what you want to do is um, up, uh, put your right leg on the brake. So you need to do this to shift gears. So only when you put your right leg on the brake um, you can move this gear box. So I have my right leg on the brake and I'm going to put the car into park so make sure it's in park. So once that's done you just have to turn the key and then your car should start right up. Okay so now it's um, time to get moving. So as you can see there are only two pedals here and there's no clutch. There's just a dead pedal here so you want to uh, rest your left leg on the dead pedal and you'll be using only your right leg for both the brake and the accelerator so first um, push down the brake so that you can move the gear selector then put the gear selector into drive so that we can move forward so slowly release the brake and um, once you slowly release the brake you'll notice that the car starts to move so uh, once the car starts to move you can you know put your foot on the accelerator and then accelerate away so uh, how an automatic car works is that um, once you get to a certain rpm the car will shift for you it will shift up or down based on you know what kind of situation you're in so um, it's pretty straightforward you just have to put your foot on the accelerator pedal and then keep driving and then <laughs> No steer, avoid obstacles and all that stuff. So now I will show you how what sports mode does. So sports mode or low gear mode basically lets you stay in a gear um, longer than you know drive would let you stay in. So it's good for hill climbs or overtakes and stuff like that. So you can put the car into sports mode and um, you can also use these paddle shifters which I have over here. So if you use the paddle shifters, the um, car will stay in whatever gear you choose, um, you know, like until you change the gear. That was it for this video guys, um, I hope you enjoyed it and if you want to see similar videos please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and also comment to let me know how to improve my videos. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you guys in the next one.